they know. Uh -huh. That's yeah, right. all we really know. Asking for requests at this late in the show is sort of like you've been doing it with somebody for an hour and 15 minutes and feeling pretty good about yourself and you're just sort of laying back, easing out of it. They say, geez, you could have done this. <laughs> Until now, I thought we were having a pretty good time. <laughs> Keep on having it. Before we go, we got to talk to you about one thing. When I tell you about one thing, I know this generation like the back of my hand, most of you anyway. I know them like the back of my hand, and this was the generation. This was the generation that spent their Friday afternoons with their last $3.50 in the record store going through the vinyls. Going through the vinyls, because in those days, we bought them by the cover. Remember? We bought them by the cover. That's why the covers were so big, so we could see them. Like, this one looks really good. I think I might get this one. We learned very quickly, we learned very quickly, anything with a pineapple scene or a Hawaiian scene on it was not a good record. <laughs> Put it over there in the negative milk cart. Okay. We bought them by the cover. We can trust the record company in those days because we still own them. We still own them. They were working for us in those days. Quickly they figured out how to get around us, but for a while the ball was in our court and we should have never given it to those douchebags. We should have never given it to them. We should have kept rock and roll right there in our pub. <laughs> you little squirty, nerdy record guy. Got to buy a bus right now. <laughs> Bottom by the cover, seven out of 10 were good still. Seven out of 10 were good, remember? Three out of ten were like the Lori Bauer singers sings Johnny Cash, but they didn't say the Lori Bauer singers sings Johnny Cash. They said Johnny Cash, remember? We took it home and we put it off. Not again. <laughs> Have to put it over there in the Hawaiian milk crate. <laughs> Seven out of ten were good. And when you didn't have to sign agree, you didn't lease the music, they couldn't find you once you bought a record, they couldn't trace you, they couldn't track you down. It was yours to do what you wanted with it. It was yours. You didn't sign agree, you didn't hit a button, submit, you didn't submit to nothing in rock and roll. Yeah, yeah. Oh. Yeah. 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 Oh yeah, hell yeah. And you took it home, and you put it on that turntable, and you took that toad arm, and you take those six or seven pennies, and you put it on that toad arm, and you work through that scratch. You work through that scratch. Ow. You work through that scratch to finally, you got to love the scratch. Years later, when you replaced that record, you missed the scratch. And you took that cassette tape, and you shoved that pencil, and you worked until you found that splice, and you scotch taped it over, and then sometimes you scotch taped over scotch tape over scotch tape. Sometimes it'd be nothing but 20 minutes of scotch tape, which didn't sound so bad once you smoked a big coner. You smoked a big coner and listened to that scotch tape, but it was analog scotch tape. It wasn't that digital crap they have today. Texting and driving, texting and driving, texting and driving was nothing compared to the eight track tape deck. <laughs> You'd be down there for half an hour without looking up some. Yeah, yeah. We've all been there. <laughs> you have the matchbook in it and your knee on it, your foot on the gas. <laughs> They found guys dead on the side of the road with Eric Burden and the animals etched in their kneecaps. <laughs> Imagine me and you, and you, the only one for me and you, and you for me. I sang it at school that way. <laughs> and I used to be this deal in rock and roll. There used to be this deal in rock and roll. We didn't hit you too hard coming in the door. And you helped us on the way out. You've been reneging on that deal a little bit lately, too. How much was it to get in tonight, man? I don't know. He paid. 
Just like 1968 tonight, just like the revolution. I want you to be back in on the deal. I want you to go over to that merchandise table, pick up a CD or a T-shirt, help me keep my little traveling show on the road. Thank you all so much. We'll see you all another time. Go the batteries. Perfect. Uh -huh. 